My role is uh, midfield development. It's uh, working with the young midfielders, um, primarily first to three year midfielders, and uh, working with the other development coaches, Luke Webster and Martin Koski, who are backs and forwards, and also a, a match day midfield coaching role with East Perth. I have been a physical education teacher for the last 16 years at uh, Christchurch Grammar School and had sort of done some community coaching uh, while I was teaching at the same time uh, at uh, amateur level and then uh, was lucky enough to uh, have a reserves coaching role last year with East Perth and at the end of 2016 uh, was approached by the club to um, if I was interested in uh, becoming a development coach. Have some composure, even if you've got pressure coming at you, have the composure to take possession first, embrace the pressure, then we're clean to give it off. We've got a bit of a strategic plan with our coaching development. You know, we like to get coaches, A, the Sam Mitchell type, you know, past player who, who are ready to grow and learn, but also a bit of local talent. And uh, Luke provides us a bit of that with his education background, his coaching abilities in his own right. So he's, he's a different dynamic for us and we think that's a really good balance to get both right and he's, he's been really good for us. What about the defenders? Nice yeah, well, he really committed uh, down last year and it's great to see him get an opportunity at the club and uh, he's tense, he's enthusiastic and um, I think you really get the best out of our developing mids. He's very, been very successful at amateur level in his coaching uh, so far and now he's here with his teaching background. Uh, it's really positive, a real positive for our group in particular with uh, including myself, ex-players uh, who don't have that background. So he's a great resource for the players and the coaches. That's good, we'll go roll away, roll two, and then a post. You know, primarily it's my role to, to make sure the players that are playing for East Perth, uh, the West Coast listed players, are, are being given the most feedback and, and allowing them to to get the most out of the feedback that they're getting from the game. So two guys, two guys are going, you don't come in and crash, crash that, okay? He's um, yeah, got to juggle 10, 12 players who all want to get into the um, AFL team. So um, for him to be able to um, help, help them develop and um, try to get them playing AFL is a very tough role. And ultimately our job as development coaches is, is, is to be developing their fundamental skills and, you know, having them become elite in those, in those areas because when they're playing Waffle League football or reserve football, that's got to be able to stand up against pressure. Leave one out to them, boys. It's an opportunity to, to be involved in an elite um, sporting or, organisation like the Eagles. Motivated young men who, who are you know, trying to get the most out of themselves um, in terms of football and I guess uh, being immersed in, a, in an environment that's elite and, and working with some fantastic coaches.